hello friends today in this tutorial we are going to learn how to assign footing in rivet structures okay footing means like our foundation okay so we'll have different types of footings first we'll see like plain footing here so this is our drawing area okay so in this our drawing area we have elevation uh, elevations okay then this is our project browser in the project browser we have here two structural plans not Floor plans, structural plans for rivet structures. So I will select here foundation level. Okay. So in the foundation level, level you have four grid lines in x axis and four grid lines in y axis. Now we have to assign the footing. For assigning footing, we'll go in the ribbon. In the ribbon, we'll go to structure tab. In the structure tab, we'll go to foundation. And in the foundation, we'll select here isolated. Okay. Isolated means our footing. For footing, it is mentioned as isolated. Now I'm clicking the footing. We can assign the footing, but before assigning the footing, now what we have to see, we have to see here the uh, sizes and all that. So this is the default loaded footing. Now you can just select the different size also. Okay. Now I will select this only. Now after selecting level here is the foundation level. Okay. Then height offset is also important in the properties palette for footing level and height offset these two options are very important these two options have to be considered very well now we'll have we have to assign footing we can assign with the center option or we can put the corner anyhow however you like you can assign your footing depending upon the requirement i will assign here with the middle option okay now my footing has been assigned this is the 3d uh, 2d view of our footing now we have to see the 3d view so for viewing 3d view we have to go to the ribbon in the ribbon select view tab then 3d view okay after 3d clicking on the 3d view this is our 3d view of our footing okay now again we'll go to the 2d plan means our structural plan foundation level then now you have to copy this footing means you want this kind of footing more three three more you required so what you will do we will click on the footing and we will go in the modify structure foundation tab in that in modify section i want to select here copy okay we will have so many options move copy rotate but i will select here copy okay after clicking on copy i will uh, click on this multiple option i will click right on click on the multiple option now i will select the reference point from which point i want to copy i will select the middle point center point then i will copy the remaining footings okay friends so this is how we copy the footings if you want to move you can click on the footing and you can move now this is our 3d view okay now this is our 3d view of our footings now if you want to change the size of this footing so click on the footing then go to properties palette in the properties palette you can change the size by clicking on the type selector and you can select the big size now our footing has been changed okay so you can do like this or you can go click on the footing and click on the edit type option and here you will find the foundation thickness width length if you want to change you want you can change it from here okay so you have two options now if you want to load the other families of structural foundation so what we have to do again same we have to go in the ribbon then in the ribbon select structure tab in the structure we have to select isolated in isolated in the modify place isolated foundation tool we'll find here load family so click on the load family option after clicking on the load family option you'll get different families so from this family select structural foundation family drag down a little bit okay now in this you will have different families will be there pile cap with two piles pile cap with three four piles five piles six piles eight piles then rectangular piles rectangular triangular anything different different kinds of things will be there so i will select here pile cap with six piles okay now i will draw i will assign here my footing or my pile pile cap with six piles now this is my 2d view now i will check the 3d view okay so for checking 3d view i'll go here in the 3d menu so this is my 3d view okay friends so this is how we assign foundation or footing in rivet structures if you find any difficulty while assigning footing in the rivet structure you can contact us through comments if you like our video then please subscribe to our channel and share with your friends share as much as possible this will encourage us 
एंड थैंक यू फॉर योर हेल्प फॉर योर सपोर्ट